Watson Tatsuyaki and Clay on LOSA have been together in Athens for several years now, and in that time have become inseparable. Oh, uh, it's no, it's like brothers, you know. We're basically like our backgrounds and stuff. You know, I know I'm Samoan, he's Tongan, but everything's one. You know, as, you know Polynesian, where we come from, it's pretty big. Well, I think they both have the Polynesian descent, and they both come from the one's Tongan, one's uh, Samoan, but they have both have that Polynesian background. So they uh, have things on the field, off the field, and then also cultural that uh, bond themselves, bond those two together. They're very talkative, <laughs> if I can put that uh, uh, loosely. Uh, but now they're they're really both having their best years this year. So uh, we're a lot of expected of them. Uh, both of them are great in the weight room. Both of them give us uh, uh, some power in the middle of the defense. In Polynesian culture, the ritual of the haka, an ancestral war cry and dance, is performed before a battle as a show of strength. This year, the duo has introduced the team to the tradition. When you grow up. In a cultural family like me, uh, you're surrounded by a lot of things like that. So as little boys, we learned it from the older boys, like learning how to do it. And, um, you know, they threw us up on the stage and they let us do it too. So being in front of people and doing it, you know, it just <clears throat> gets you excited. So I thought just bringing it to the team would just, you know, bring more excitement there and more energy so we could just come out and fly around. We do it like every time when we, especially like, like our, our big games against like other schools and stuff like we always do the haka and it's like something our culture always do too it's like kind of traditional kind of that means like like warrior you know you gotta be that that one warrior to to stand up in, in front of the, the whole crowd to lead to lead the, the, the crowd and if the crowd is pumped, then one can imagine what the players felt when they first learned it. They're excited because of like the yelling and like the high intense, you know, slapping, and uh, just like the team bonding. You know, when we when we when we do our pregame ritual, it's like it's just one, so nobody can't be, you know, late to saying the call or anything. Everybody got to be as one because when you hear it, it just it gets you that spirit and energy inside. It's just like one, it warms you up and um, it just makes you play harder, I guess.